Former President Bill Clinton was in Columbia today at USC helping to honor a former member of his cabinet and former governor, Dick Riley. Yeah, J.R. Barry was there and he joins us now with details on this special event. J.R., we've had so many presidents here in South Carolina lately. <laughs> yeah, we have. And uh, Bill Clinton says he started coming to South Carolina when he was 25 years old, the 42nd president coming today for a very special occasion, and that is to honor his friend, former governor and former education superintendent Dick Riley. Now, earlier today, the yeah. former governor himself Welcome. was at the Richard W. Riley uh, collection that is on display inside the Ernest Holling Special Collections Library on the USC campus. Now, this contains hundreds of thousands of documents, a collection of papers, pictures, and videos. It took five years to put all of this together, and you think five years, that's a long time, but Dick Riley has over 50 years of public service, so in the grand scheme of things, five years to get all of these papers together not that long now riley talked to us earlier today he said he is happy that the display is at usc one thing i would hope that people who look through this collection <clears throat> would say uh, public service uh, can be uh, worthwhile and can be exciting and interesting but if you really are going to be uh, good at public service, you have to be committed to the public good. That has to be underneath everything. In Burlington, Vermont. In reflecting now this afternoon, President Clinton came in around shortly after 3 o'clock this afternoon. He spoke a little more than 20 minutes about his longtime friend. Here's some of the things he had to say. These papers reflect a man who had the single most important quality of a public servant. He kept score in the right way. In our family, we have always had a saying, even before the heartbreak of 2016 for us, which is that nobody guarantees you a win, but you're bound to show up and try. Get caught trying. Dick Riley got caught trying based on this scorecard. Will people be better off when I quit than when I started? Will children have a brighter future? Will it bring us together or tear us apart? These papers will show you that when it comes to what he did and how he treated people, the answer to all three questions was and remains a resounding yes. Now, one thing, ladies, that we can say, this event was supposed to start at 3 o'clock this afternoon, but President Clinton, unlike him, he got here a little early, and so things started just a little bit earlier and wrapped up a little early as well. Of course, if you were around for the Clinton administration, you know things operated on Clinton standard time, as we called it, whenever the president would simply show up. But all in all, a great afternoon here for the former governor, Dick Riley. Oh, a nice day honoring him. Thank you so much, JR. Exciting anytime we have a president here in the Midlands.